Press the house for one minute. The gentleman is recognized. Paid uh, four dollars and one cents a gallon at home in Oregon last weekend. There's a lot of people got long-term plans, drill now, drill here, drill everywhere, conservation, whatever. Say, there's nothing we can do in the short term. Well, there is. 70%, 70% of the oil futures, the supply of oil, is owned by speculators on Wall Street and, and other places around the world. 70%. The head of ExxonMobil testified that about... Uh, $38 a barrel is due to speculation. That's the head Exxon Mobil. He says, we're paying 38 bucks a barrel for speculators on Wall Street. Goldman Sachs says, well, it's only $22 to $28 a barrel. Let's take the lowest number, $22 a barrel. That would lower regular gas by 64 cents a gallon if we got rid of the speculators. I've proposed a tax of one one hundredth of one cent per transaction that would drive most of these speculators out of the market and raise some revenues. It's time to get rid of the speculators, provide price relief to Americans, and have then we can talk about a long-term plan for energy self-sufficiency. For what purpose does the gentleman from Texas rise?